Well, I'm Ranger Cookie, and I want to show you something. Phyllis, Philip or Phyllis, I'm sorry, uh, names are like cards. You throw them up and try to grab one. One of my subscribers and one of my other subscribers gave me one of these. Phyllis, um, Philly or whatever your name, I'm sorry. But she gave me uh, this little item, and I finally got a use for it. And the Voodoo guy. The Voodoo, uh, he only has like six subscribers. He only has one video. Is this us? He he suffers from some stuff like I suffer from. But I took this and made fishing poles out of it. What? How you make fishing poles out of this? Where's a fishing pole? Well, it's a little kit. I put this in a medicine bottle with two of these, my fishing rod, or I'm sorry, rod reel, and a multi tool. I always put a multi tool in my fishing kit because you never know when you need to use a multi tool. This one has a flashlight and pliers, whatever. You've seen this in one of my videos. So, what I do. I take this stick, I put my fishing pole here. So, how, what's in this? Let's find out. Come over here, look at me. All right, what's in this container? Well, let's find out. What you wanna do is open your container and pull out these eyes. See, I have these eyes in the same, this other container, this is another fishing pole. Then you want to go out and cut you a nice straight stick. Now, a fishing pole is light. You don't have to bring the rod because your rod is going to be your stick outside in the, uh, in the uh, bush. So you just have to cut your nice long stick. Find the one you like. I like this one because it's pretty straight. Put your fishing rod. Make sure your left or right hand. Make sure you put it on the right side. Place your two little, you can use zip ties, which would be easy, but you have to bring zip ties all the time. Then you're gonna have trash. We try to avoid trash. We don't wanna leave trash in, 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 in the parks or in the wilderness. Then you have to bring it out. This, if you have a multi tool, you just tighten this up. All right, I'll be back. You know what? I'm all right, I find this is a pain in the ass, so I just use rope. It's gonna be there, I guess. Now, what you wanna do is take your eyes. Now, you wanna put the biggest eye towards the top of your fishing pole. Three drill holes work, does work. Let's see if I can put a small one. All right, all right, I'll be back. All right, what I'm doing is taking my knife and pre-drilling a hole. Then I'm taking one of my little eyes and put it in the hole. Now this beats carrying a whole big old pole, it might break. So you can make one in the middle of the woods, like I'm doing here. Let's see, about right here. You don't have to use all these eyes, you just need a couple eyes.
I might get larger eyes because these these eyes are really this is my first make in the pole but I know how I make the damn thing I'll be back all right sorry it took so long but this is very hard wood what you want to do is tie your fishing pole your I'm sorry your fishing pole to your rod then from the rod you want to put your eyelids or your eyes you don't have to put all of them you just carry extra in case you drop a few and after you get your your pole ready, you just line your fishing string through your eyes. I recommend hardwood because uh, you're going to do a lot of swinging. You might have a heavy bait on there. And after that, just line your fishing pole. Now, I got my fishing pole, and I'm ready to fish away. There you go, you got the cookie pole. Remember, everything is the cookie way. Now, you don't have to bring a fishing pole. You might break the fishing pole. But hey, you can make one in the middle of the woods with these eye rings. Look down here. Look at this. I want to thank Phyllis for this little fishing kit I made with her little cup. Get you a bunch of these little eyes. Make sure you get I, this is very hard wood and preset your holes if you want to use the same stick. You can also use the same stick as a walking stick. Look at me! I hope you enjoy the cookie bowl. What y'all think? A good, a good fishing rod? Yeah. Maybe if I had it long enough, it'd be a good fly rod. But this little bayou, you don't need a fishing rod that hell goes 100 feet. There you go. The cookie bowl. I hope you enjoyed my videos. Thank you to Phyllis and uh, the Blue View. He only has one video. It's something else. It's not the Voodoo. It's the Voodoo guy. And I finally used the little gift he gave me. I made a fishing kit for a fishing pole. I put the little eye hooks in it. And that's all you had to do is carry your rod and reel and your your baits and your hooks and your lines. And a multi-tool. Alright, I'm Ranger Cookie. I hope you enjoy this video of the cookie pole. Cookie, cookie pole. Look at that. Can you beat that? Look at that. Look at that. Alright. I'll see you next video. Mama Larry. Before I leave, this is basically all you have to carry. I, the P, I have a PPC pipe, and this is lighter than a PC pipe, and it's heavier, 
and stronger than a PC pipe. All right, I'm Ranger Cookie. I hope you enjoy the cookie pole.